مرحبا ادهم وهذا الفيديو مميز شوي صراحه لانه في شويه تغيير عن كل الفيديوهات اللي عندنا في القناه في المانيا تحديدا في برلين كان مؤتمر هواوي اللي اعلنوا فيه عن معالجهم الجديد كيرين 980 هو الجيل الثاني او الجيل اللي بعده من هذا المعالج قالوا انه الذكاء الصناعي تطور فيه صار افضل من اول صار يعني اقوى من اول وصار اول كانوا يعتبرونه في خليه ذكاء واحده كذا اقدر اختصرها لكم الان صار في خليتين فبالتالي يفترض انه افضل اتيحت لنا فرصه جدا مهمه جلسنا مع النائب رئيس قطاع الجوالات في هواوي الصين يعني هواوي عالميا وهذه فرصة اعتبرها كبيرة جدا اللي يتكلم عن معالجها القادم تكلم عن شوية تلميحات عن جهازهم القادم والأهم من ذلك وهم فقره في الفيديو بأنه نعم وصلنا لإدارة هواوي على طول بعض الأسئلة بعض وجهة نظركم أو الشغلات اللي أنت تبونها في جهازتهم فخلونا نشوف إيش قال مع بعض وإيش تكلم عن هذه الشغلات So today I bring you maybe the world most powerful and intelligent Seven nano chipset, our mobile AI chipset. This one. I think the most important is the processor, the new technology for the processor, and then the seven nanometers. Uh, you know, last generation we provided the, the first generation uh, one MPU, but this time we provide two. That means we can um, provide more powerful computing um, capability. For example, for the video. Real video, we can make the uh, object recognition and also the facial recognition. That means we can help to uh, provide maybe the best video recording effects. Oh, of, of course, I think video will be the trend because uh, a lot of uh, short video application already become more and more popular. Maybe not only this year, in the future, the video will become more and more popular. Uh, first, I want to confirm uh, because the Mate is Huawei's flagship models. So every time for the newest Mate product, we will use the newest chipset. So this year, we will use the new chipset. So please remember for the Mate, every time we will use our newest chipset. The P series and Mate series still have different, have something different. You know what I mentioned? It's just uh, talking about the performance. Because for the Mate series, uh, it's using the most uh, new, newest chipsets. But for the P series, we will focus on the art and the, and the design. And uh, you know the camera. We will also uh, put uh, the, the camera, uh, the, the, the top one for the P series. And the Mate series, maybe sometime, maybe not so many new technology on the camera for the Mate series. But for the Mate, maybe we, we don't make so many uh, emphasis on the, on the color. <laughs> and compared with, uh, uh, with the P20 Pro, uh, because we know uh, we have a lot of advantage technology on the Kirin 980. Uh, for example, uh, we use a, a 7 nanometer processor. And that means we can provide uh, more powerful computing capability with uh, limited, with less power consumption. And the second one is we provide, uh, we use the advanced CPU, uh, and also this chipset uh, we provide eight core, eight core, two super big core, two big core, and uh, four small core. So that means we can use a different core to, for the different application. For example, if we want to play a gaming, that means we need to use a super big core. That means we need to, uh, because the latency and also the gaming experience is very important. But for the social, social application, maybe we can use a, a, a just a big core. That's enough. And uh, even for the, some calling, some message, we just use a small core, that's enough. So that means we can adjust the, 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 the computing performance and also we can save the power consumption. We didn't know 
uh, our emotion UI, our target is for the global user. But today, I think we are not so good for the global. And that's why we invest a lot of for the local R&D team. And my team, we put maybe uh, more than 10 person here, and we want to know what's the uh, really need for the local consumer. Yeah, we, we are trying. We are trying to optimize our, our emotional life. Uh, this year, uh, H1, we already become the number two. We still have some distance, especially on the software experience and also the ecosystems. And we can provide a very, very good product now, especially on the hardware, camera technology, AI. But uh, that's still something we need to, to, to do. We need to invest. It's very difficult to say how, how many years we, we, we need. And uh, I know uh, the other window also going forward. Uh, but it seems we are moving more faster. <laughs>